stop at that one box. But if you plant in different boxes, every box has a different quantity and quality of a mixture of manure. manure. So this one will show you that either they are sick or they have been affected by something. Mm. Mm -hmm. But then the rest are ready for, for what? For planting. So you see some onions there. And then over here, we have this. This, this, is, this is parsley. Parsley, but then it grows, looks like this. Looks like that. Over there is a spinach bed. That is spinach growing. But this one, this one is parsley. Mm. And this one we use it for juices. Yes, and a little bit of, of garnishing of the foods. You can see a fully grown broccoli, which is ready for eating. Mm. Mm. So, so how effective is a box uh, farming box from farming, the others? Box farming is very good because one, you can, from one box, for example, somebody can can have a, a farm, uh, can have a farm of uh, of produce, but for you to separate that farm, eh, to separate or to to, dip, to demarcate areas where you're going to plant something small and something which would take more nutrients mm. it would not be easy for you to do that but when you have a box you can see that this box the manure i'm going to use is just going to be good enough for broccoli to grow and these are big leaf plants big leaf plants need a certain depth of soil and they also need a certain quantity or quality of manure okay or fertilizers but for plants like lettuce which do not need so much uh so much uh so much uh, fertilizing and you're not going to spray them like you spray the broccoli mm. you, you put them in a different place so when you put them in a different place it is easier for them to grow without affecting without without your sprays affecting them so that's why the box can separate can help you separate where to spray where to fertilize most where to do uh where to do even the watering most because now mm -hmm. broccoli will have uh, some consumption of water which is more than the lettuce okay. yes and also, so that you don't waste water, you don't waste it. So even this, the, the Nakati. Now, Nakati has a challenge nowadays. It is getting a lot of fungus. These fungus, they will not affect the plants which are in the boxes. They will not affect the plants which are in other. Okay. So pest control mm -hmm. also is managed by boxing. Mm -hmm. uh, or bo garden, uh, garden boxes. Or box garden. Okay. Okay. And also it is easier for you to demarcate where to put your bed. The nursery bed will stay here, then you know that from this bed, I'm going to plant this spinach here. Okay, okay. I'm going to plant this there. And over there, you can see like in that bed there, we have uh, beetroot is growing. Mm? Some here, mm? you see some beetroot there growing. And then we have here, uh, now this, this, this was, there was some nakati here, but this beetroot growing, here you can see there is some, there is uh, some sukumawiki. And then there there is spinach. spinach. So with boxes, it is easy for you to, to put your bed nicely. But if it was like in a big farm, mm. you'd fa you'd need to demarcate a whole area just for beds. True. True. Okay. So if you are spraying other crops, you maybe you are put there some tomatoes, and it's a season you would like to reap so much from your tomatoes, but at the same time you also want to reap from these colored the nakatis. Mm -hmm. It would be good for you to spray your things differently because every every plant needs a different kind of spray season. Some need after 10 days, some need after just a, a, a week or something. Then also if you have plants which will take so long in the garden, mm -hmm. like this one, garlic, it, uh -oh. it will take so long in the garden, it will almost take a year in the garden. So you'd like to separate a box for it or a farm area for it and with boxes it's much simpler. You put them here and then you forget and you go do other things, you do other things. Mm. One other thing about the boxes, like for, for plants like Nakati, eh? for plants like Nakati, these ones, you are going to, to, to put enough manure, enough manure and enough soil which is going to manage the growth of more than 
10 or 20 times of harvest. Okay. Not even just 20, it can be it can be it can be tens of times when you harvest from here. When I start harvesting and I pluck out, 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 I sell. The next time, all I have to do is to pour water. Mm -hmm. Because for seeds like Nakati, you just throw. It's, it's, called, it's, it's done by broadcasting. It's okay. called broadcast method. Mm -hmm. You just throw like that and everything will grow. But some plants, as you pluck out, some are still young, if you can look there. Mm -hmm. Some are still young. So as you spray or as you put water, as you pour, as you as you keep watering, the ones which are under will grow as you have removed the older ones. Oh yes. Oh, yes. Oh, so yes. you will have tens of times of, of harvesting. Yes. Mm -hmm. So in one just just one box you would get a lot of plants which would which you would plant in so in a very, very large area. So sure. it's also about area. Okay. Space company. Space management. Mm. Or space management. That's good. Yes. For example, garlic near like parsley or some other colors, they will change color. Oh. They will not get enough nutrients. Okay. Yes. Okay. It okay. will just affect them, the acidity because they need a certain kind of alkalinity in them so they will change oh, I see. they will now take the nutrients from the other plants and the other plants will start mm. to will start to will, will actually look lush green instead of looking <laughs> instead of being dark green mm. Mm. yes so that's what happens when you have garlic or onions where you are going to plant things which are like mawichi or parsley or broccoli or things like that okay yes time will come when now the plant it has now given you enough and you have to uproot and change True. All we have to do, dig through the soil, add a little bit of manure. It could be uh, the, the, the coffee husk with chicken, with chicken, uh, with chicken, uh, chicken dump uh, manure. Mm. Or you can even put rabbit urine or something uh, to do with rabbit, uh, rabbit dung, which has, been, which has been left in a bag to, 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 to go, you know, to, to decompose. And then you just add it here and keep growing other things. So, pest control, space management, sp uh, 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 spraying, and things like that. This is why we have boxes, and this is very important for us. Okay. Yes.